Will you start? It, all right. Uh, hi, Mike here. I want to show you how to fix this E3 error on your uh, whole house humidifier. So the first thing you could do, easiest thing, is actually just try to reset the system. So you put in a reset for like three or four seconds, then you come back. Oh, see, it resets itself, but mine's going to go back into error. See, goes right back in error. So we have a bigger problem here. So to do to fix this, we need to take this off. We need to take this off, uh, and we need a multimeter. Um, but we also need this table, and I'll put this in the link to this. We need to know what the outdoor temperature is. So here it's 47. So this says I need around 23 uh, ohms of resistance because there's an outdoor unit or an outdoor thermos. Uh, uh, resistor basically and depending on the temperature outside uh, the resistance goes up or down okay so that's what tells that's what controls this and tells it how much humidity it needs to add to the system so there's obviously something wrong with that it's not working so what we're looking for is the ODT and the wire right to the right and we want to measure the resistance on there okay so if I do that here I am and I already did this I'm showing zero Wait, oh, basically zero, okay? So what that's telling me is that there's a break in the system. Um, so what we need to do is we're gonna go outside and I'm gonna follow this wire through the whole entire system to the outdoor um, uh, resistor and I'll, sh I'll splash up a picture of that. And make sure that the wire's running all the way there and there's no cuts in the line. If there's no cuts in a line, most likely that outdoor uh, resistor is bad. So you just gotta go in line and order another one. They're actually really cheap and just swap it out. Now, if you swap it out and it still doesn't work, then you probably have a cut in the line somewhere else. So what you have to do is then just run a new thermostat line from the ODT and the one next to it all the way out to the uh, resistor. Okay, so there's a couple different ways that this can play out, but I think I'm just going to go outside and I think I'm going to find that there's a break. So I was doing some landscaping. I think I, I hit the wire. All right, so I'm outside and this is where mine's wired up. So you can see the wire comes out of the house and I have it connected here, um, kind of temporarily actually. And then this runs and this is the outside unit. So what I'm going to do is just check to make sure there's no break in the line. I have a feeling there is because a, a branch yesterday fell down on this and pulled it down. All right, so it definitely was a break in the system here. So here's the next, we're gonna put this back together and this time I'm actually gonna use wire nut, which I didn't use before. And this is very low, this is just signal wire. So it's not like there's any current or anything going through this. All right, and I think once I put this back together, go back inside, reset the entire system, that we will, we will have no more problems back inside all right we came back in and that did fix it the outdoor uh fixing those those wires by the time i came back in actually it reset itself um i was kind of surprised uh so all you got to do if it doesn't reset itself is run it to the reset all the way there all the way to the end and then just run it back and you can see mine is, is good now. Um, now, if you, like I said, if you don't find a break in the wire, then your resistor outside might be bad. You can probably pick one up for like 10 bucks online. Um, if you've replaced that, that still doesn't do it, then you probably have a break somewhere else in the system. I would just run a new line, thermostat line, from the outdoor unit all the way in and just replace it you know, on the prongs inside there. Okay, I'll put some more information down below um, on what, what things to check and everything like that. Uh, but hopefully this uh, video was helpful. If it was, please subscribe, please like, please comment. Thank you.